Stacey, how do you increase ferritin levels when all your other iron markers are normal? This becomes um, a very interesting, complex thing when you're trying to fight a doctor about your ferritin levels. Um, so the best way that we can look to increase the ferritin levels, because they won't give you an infusion if all your other iron markers are normal, is to look at using something like carbonyl iron, which is very highly bioavailable without the side effects, and dosing every other day away from coffee, away from dairy, preferably away from a meal, so maybe halfway through the day or before bed, um, and definitely not around training because we see that your inflammatory markers that inhibit iron absorption stay elevated for three to five hours after training. So if you're doing it every other day and ideally first thing in the morning, but if you're having coffee, that doesn't work. So you can push it to right before bed. Then you're going to bring your ferritin levels up over the course of a month to two months. If they still stay down after that, and you have normal iron markers, then you do have to have a conversation with your physician about how am I gonna increase this? Maybe I do need an infusion.